Today we are going to be showing you how to troubleshoot fault code 311 on your JLG electric scissor lift. The 311 fault code will be displayed on the JLG analyzer. The platform distress light will have a 3, 1 flash code. All functions on the lift will be disabled. And there will be no audible click when the machine is powered on. This fault can occur with either the Sefkin or ZAPI power modules. Some possible causes for this are A faulty power module A faulty contactor Or faulty wiring Troubleshooting steps With a multimeter, check the battery voltage between the B- terminal of the power module and the battery side of the contactor. It should be at 24 volts. Check all of the battery cables and connections for tightness and cleanliness. Then load test the batteries. For the Sefkin power module, check all the connections on the power module. At the contactor check for 24 volts between the two yellow slash red wires numbered 257 and 256. If yes, next check the resistance between the contactor coil terminals. This should be approximately 52 ohms. If there is no voltage, check J1-19 at the ground module for voltage. If you get voltage, next check pin 1 of the 12 pin connector on the Sevkin. If 24 volts is present, recheck 2-5-6 at the contactor using B- as the ground. If there is no voltage, repair wiring. If there is voltage, Check pin 8 of the 12 pin connector. It should drop to near 0 volts when the machine is powered up. If the voltage does not drop, perform an electrical evaluation of the power module. 3 for the ZAPI control module, check all the connections on the control module. At the contactor check for 24 volts between the two coil wires 41-3 nmc and 23-4 pmc. If yes, next check the resistance between the contactor coil terminals. Should be approximately 52 ohms. If no voltage is present, check between J1-13 and J1-32 during power up. If yes, repair the wiring to the contactor. Thanks for watching. You can find all the parts and equipment used in this video over on our website gciron.com.